trade. I think he went for an optimal trade combo, but <gasps> it was just not close enough. And Tweedy gets the point blank throw. What oh a win! my word, he dashes into it. And there he goes. Oh, he's doing it. He's <laughs> saying, pick someone else. He's literally pick saying, someone else. pick someone else. Pick a different character because this will not work. But what is Sonic for? He, knew. he was either going to go for a knockdown or a restand there with the bar. Oh, I think Big D just trying to test the waters. That down one, not sure. Oh, tries to anti air the Canary Cry, but not able to. And that goes straight into a command grab. It's the minion also. Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Just relentless, man. Absolutely relentless. No clash in sight. And dead. Wow. 100% dead. Wow. <laughs> Storm with so much ambiguous moves when you're stunned like that. Still though, Big D, he's looking pretty healthy, but the problem is he doesn't have the clash anymore. And having no clash against a character like Firestorm that really wants to mix you up in situations exactly oh, like this no! is very dangerous. And Sonic Fox now, one mix up away from taking Big D out of the winner's bracket. What's going to be? Oh, the bag! Oh my word, he gets the insane, insane cross up that was not a cross up. The tea bag, both tactical. And just that, PM, that really. was a tactical teabag if ever I've seen one. That was not a ha ha, look at me, I've won the game. It's you have to guess for the game here. So I'm going to disrespect the absolute hell out of you so you get a bit flustered. Because Big D, he's an emotional player. You know, I don't want to say he's automatically going to fall apart when that happens. But I like the idea of Moss coming in and maybe do meter burn back three, maybe Oki trying to react to a dash up or, or whatever have you. But instead, playing a lot of his offense revolving around this background bounce. And Brian is able to set oh. things up, command grab on the mix up. And he has all all of his bar, he could just put this man in mixed town. It's about to be population. Mr. Mouse wants to guess, and it's another unblockable. Look at all the meter he has. And just like I talked about, as long as he has the bar, he becomes a blender. <laughs> if you walk into a Walmart, you look at the most expensive one. This man is the projectiles that do massive damage on here, and they're hard to get around with the release. The galactic jumping, and now here comes River King with the bar for the vortex. But instead, opt to go for the treat. Yeah, he actually could have got a grapple out. Maybe he was afraid of an oh escape. Oh my Meter God! At the end, put this guy on the map. I mean. MK9 was his first competitive game, of course, <laughs> but now running through to X later on, and now Injustice 2. Wait a minute, do we have Whoa, a chains off? What? I did not expect to see this so early. It's way too spicy for, well, midday. It's not morning anymore. That line we're just going to throw out the window. It doesn't so exist. So the first matchup was whose shades were more appropriate. Regardless. Oh, <laughs> nice, nice job, though, from both players. Mm -hmm. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> That's <is> talent! <laughs> <laughs> why, do we John, see, why do we see that? Jumping is a multi-talented person. It is that is that is a uh, hands-free. <laughs> that was impressive. It was enough to take him out of the game, so he just kind of bounced out of existence once he hit the ground. As you know, again, another game could have easily That's been. It. Every hit, this might be it. Tweedy, he has two bars, but doesn't get the chance to rewind with a jump in. He tries to catch him down. And the block damage! No more rewind is your Evo 2018 World Champion for Injustice 2. Tweedy's gonna be devastated with that one. You can see it in his body language, but I mean the man of the hour is rewind. The young blood showing why the new generation of Netherrealm players, I mean these guys are the future. Indeed, absolutely hard yeah. of him to find the time to use it. And Tweedy is not going to be shy of building that resource back. The hair flip is unsafe, so here comes the Tamaranian charge into respectable damage. Delayed wake up to deny, but he tries to combo off the cluster trade. I think he went for an optimal trade combo, but <gasps> was just not close enough. And Tweedy gets the point blank throw. What oh way? my word, he dashes into it. And there he goes. Oh, he's doing it. He's <laughs> saying, pick someone else. He's literally pick saying, someone else. pick someone else. Pick a different character because this will not work. But what does Sonic Fox do? Does he do as he is told and pick someone else, or did he stick with it? I think if, if it's if it's do the comeback factor of this character is insane. Oh, oh, no. oh no. no! My goodness, she's dead. She oh is my dead. God. She is dead and then some. My lord, Biohazard. Oh my god. I mean. And oh she, my god! And the shrug of the shoulders, shrug of the shoulders. What what more is there to do when you have the life lead and then all of a sudden you don't? I, oh, baby. That's just the way the cookie crumbles, my oh, friend. Oh, you, you slider. And Coach Steve going down to Theo 3 0. Well, that is a bit more one sided than I was anticipating, but a good game nonetheless. Of course, Coach Steve, he's down in the loser's bracket, but definitely still has an opportunity to get his way through that. You know, we, we do commonly refer to Loser's Bracket as a bit of a shark tank and because of people like him being in it, you know, and uh, of course he's going to be moving on through 
and uh, hopefully we'll be seeing more of him later on. <laughs> Whatever you have to put out. Man. So that was, a, that was a good studied way on how to play that matchup, I think. And Book just ran through that one. And oh my god, we got a, another Korean monster. Oh. Johnny D, aka John Ding, with the new UIU shirt that has everyone's name on there. Yeah, that UIU shirt's sick, actually. You see, like, the little words around the Y it has everybody, every one of the UIU players' name on there. It's funny how some of them are like, like John Ding has a pretty big, like, like his name's pretty big, but yeah. they're like through Kizzy, like right in the corner. It's like Kizzy <laughs> in the smallest one because they could have been. Main stage at Evo 2018. I hope you guys are ready because this game that's about to happen right here had an infinitely better time showing up at the Evo main stage. I'm not going to name the game, but there's enough. There's, we're not gonna, we're not gonna, we're not gonna get into that. <laughs> no, I'm no BM. All right, guys, look. Okay, it's yeah. Well, he does dress like a 12 year old. Yeah, he's going to be on, uh, we're going to have him on camera real soon, but Trungi, former Steve player, he's been switching the geese since his release on Intentional Rhymes, but he's been having quite a bit of success. He's just, he got top eight at CEO, uh, I think just short of top eight at, no. Top eight combo breaker. Yeah, top eight at combo breaker, just short of top eight at uh, CEO, I believe. Right. Mateo didn't even know he was going to be here. Yeah, he bought his flight. Thursday. <laughs> he was like, oh, I signed up for the 1 1. Is that going to go under? Oh, no, nice. he got the block. Dude, oh, yo. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. He's a bomber for He was scared. He was scared when that rage art was activated. Lohai, Lohai is not interested in any of the theatrics whatsoever. Man, Lohai is not amused in the slightest. <laughs> yeah. Yo, pop up. Yo, dude. Uh. Oh man, Dune <laughs> is going crazy. You know, if I was low high, I would have almost thought like, I, <laughs> while, while he was while he was celebrating, I would have been like, rematch, rematch, rematch. Yeah, I, pay attention. I would have totally. But he mad. can't because he wants. He's thinking about going to Shaheen. I'd pick the Brian. Now low high. I would be if I was low high. I would be rude and I would pick the Brian. Oh, back four. This cabbage, cabbage, <laughs> cabbage patching nonsense. Nah, but he, all know, the way to he oblivion. knows though that his main, his main is Shaheen. He immediately chose Shaheen. Yeah, Shaheen also does very well versus. No one knows this. So Deoxys, please don't yell at me later. He had a scare first round against a Swamp Thing player. What? Was it three two? Uh, I can't remember the exact set, his set, but uh, I think it was three one. But but he had to make a comeback for the final game, like a full health bar comeback, because. Uh, he kept disrespecting Swamp Thing's wake up by trying all the cross up shenanigans. And Nier's not doing that against the tree. Swamp yeah, Thing says no to that. Yes. Let's get, see if we can get out of here. Well, Make the it. important thing is that he was able to conquer it and move on. And since then, he's looked the so. Challenge. Oh, Ooh, wow. Disrespects. And now he cannot clash and he cannot air tech. That's what happens when you give Tweedy oh, the mirror look at match. This. Wow. I oh, wish I wow. could. I wish I could have known what he said there. I wish I could have known. I mean, he just he, he, he just annihilated the mirror. That's what he wanted. He said before, you know, give her to me, challenge me in the mirror, pick Starfire against me, see how that goes. And what we right saw. Now, trying to go for the open up. Look, he's just playing so ignorant right now because he's just trying to land the random hit. He knows that's all he needs. Sonic Fox, one more for the championship. Oh, big body combos. What are we gonna do to open him up? Nice block. Sonic Fox playing a nice and slow with the 16. This is crazy. This is like the only time we see Cell really not looking at his strongest.